Hi guys. It is collage time. Yay! I love collage time. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Alright, so we are in the season of autumn. Maybe it's winter. It's hard to tell in Northern Virginia. It'll be summer tomorrow. Or spring. You can't tell. But we are in a season. And we're going to call it autumn. Or fall. So we're going to make a collage. And we're going to create some fall or autumn trees. So here are the instructions. Easy peasy. So we'll do it together. So we're going to start. Here it is. So if you want to freeze frame it, you can. But we'll do it together. So we're going to start with the tree trunk, which is just a line. We can make it a little thicker at the bottom if we need to, because the trunk is always thicker than the branches, right? So we'll draw a couple of different tree trunks. So that we can do a few different trees. Okay? So we have the tree trunks. And we're using a black sharpie for this part, right? We have our tree trunks. Now we're going to add some branches. Add different types of branches. So this is probably like a maple tree. The pretty leaves that change colors right before they fall off and have to rake them all. We get a lot of leaves around here. So let's say this is a maple leaf tree. And this tree, let's say this is a, like a Christmas tree, an evergreen tree. Or a pine tree, that's probably more like a pine tree. And then we have all these beautiful trees that I don't know the names of, like crepe myrtles and, uh, I don't know, I'm not an arborist, but there are lots of trees that have pretty flowers. So we're going to draw some other kind of branches, right? more. You can draw any kind of branches you like. It is your tree. You can draw any kind of leaves you like. Draw a couple different kinds. Alright, now after you have your trees and the branches, we're going to add color. So, autumn has different color leaves. So sometimes the leaves are brown right before they fall off. Sometimes they're green. They stay green all the time like an evergreen tree. That's why they call them evergreens because they're forever green. Sometimes the leaves turn red. You know what other colors they might turn? Yellow. Yes. Orange. all those colors. So let me get add a little orange in here. They turn all those beautiful colors right before they fall. And that's why they call it fall, because all the leaves fall off. Right. So once you have your leaves on your tree, this is when the magic happens. You are then going to take a regular bottle of water. We've done this before. And we're going to spray it. Spray it very lightly and then we're going to let it dry. But what happens is the colors start to blend and mix together and it will create a soft watercolor effect. So I'm just going to move this out of our way for now and show you what a dry one looks like. Okay, so here's our dry one. So it is a collage. And what do we do with collage? We cut. So I'm going to cut out some of my trees. In different shapes. Okay. 
table was a little bit wet there. It's a cold. I'm going out my tree, my tree. What will be really good as the leaves start to fall off the trees in your area, you could add them to your collage. Give it a more three-dimensional effect. I'm going really fast here, but you're going to take your time. I think my last tree that I'm putting out. Okay. Clean up my mess a little bit here. So I have my trees cut out. Now I need a background. So for my background, I did the same thing. I did blues on the top and greens on the bottom. And I sprayed it with water and let it dry. And I got this really cool like watercolor effect. I got this really cool watercolor effect. So I have my trees that I need to glue on to my collage. Let's see, I'm going to arrange them how I like. And let's see. Now I just need the glue. some space for uh, leaves that I'm going to go get out of my yard when it stops raining from my collage. I'm going to pause it here. Okay, I found some leaves in my yard. I'm going to glue these on. For this, I'm using liquid Elmer's because the glue stick won't work as well. So I'm going to add some dimension so it's not just flat for my autumn collage. What else could you add? If you had pine cones or acorns, you could add those. The big leaf. So I can't wait to see what you add on your collage. Search your yard, your neighborhood. And see what you could find for your fall collage. And submit a photo. I can't wait to see. Have a good day, guys.